What if the Star Wars sequel trilogy is erased from canon? Hey, Star Wars fans! Welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an exciting topic to discuss. What if the Star Wars sequel trilogy was erased from canon and replaced with the original Timothy Zahn heir to the Empire trilogy? Join us as we delve into this alternate scenario and explore the potential legacy of a beloved expanded universe. Before we dive into the what-if scenario, let's quickly recap the heir to the Empire trilogy by Timothy Zahn. In this original expanded universe story, set five years after the events of Return of the Jedi, we see a new republic struggling to establish itself while facing the threat of a resurgent empire led by the enigmatic Grand Admiral Thrawn. Picture this, Episode 7, Star Wars, Heir to the Empire. The story starts with Luke Skywalker, Leia Organa, Han Solo, and the rest of our beloved characters working to solidify the fragile New Republic. Suddenly, Grand Admiral Thrawn, a strategic mastermind from the remnants of the Empire, emerges to challenge our heroes and restore order to the galaxy under the Imperial banner. One of the most exciting aspects of the Heir to the Empire trilogy is further developing our favorite characters. Luke Skywalker embraces his role as the new Jedi Order's leader and faces moral dilemmas as he navigates the fine line between the light and dark sides of the Force. Leia Organa becomes an influential political figure, actively participating in the leadership of the New Republic while dealing with the struggles of being a mother and a leader. Han Solo continues to be the charming scoundrel we know and love, but his character arc deepens as he grapples with his family responsibilities and loyalty to his friends. We also meet new characters like Mara Jade, a former Emperor's hand-turned-Jedi, whose relationship with Luke Skywalker adds a thrilling dynamic to the story. One of the central themes of the Heir to the Empire trilogy is the idea of legacy. The original Star Wars trilogy was all about new hope and the legacy of the Jedi. Similarly, this expanded universe storyline explores the legacy of the Rebellion and the enduring struggle between good and evil. Grand Admiral Thrawn embodies the concept of legacy, showcasing the Empire's determination to rise again, preserving its heritage, and restoring order in the galaxy. It creates a captivating conflict that explores the depths of loyalty, sacrifice and the consequences of one's actions. If the heir to the Empire trilogy replaced the sequel trilogy, it would profoundly impact the Star Wars universe. Fans would witness the return of the original characters, their growth, and their continued adventures in a way that is true to the spirit of the original films. Furthermore, this alternate timeline would introduce new storylines, planets, and conflicts, enriching the Star Wars lore and providing endless opportunities for spin-offs, books, and future films. Exploring the what-if scenario of erasing the canonical sequel trilogy and replacing it with Timothy Zahn's heir to the Empire trilogy fills us with excitement. The original expanded universe storylines captivated millions of fans, and the opportunity to witness the continued adventures of our favorite characters is a tempting prospect. But what are your thoughts? Do you think the heir to the Empire trilogy would have been a worthy successor to the original Star Wars films? Share your opinions and ideas in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel. May the Force be with you. Thanks for watching.